Senores, in this video, I'm going to be responding to a comment that was left on one of my videos on Eckhart Tolle. If you have any questions, feel free to just ask me them. I love answering questions. It's from CSE, and he asked, Hi, great video. Nice to see more and more men are also on this journey. I haven't read A New Earth yet, but read The Power of Now multiple times. Every time I discover and feel new aspects and what he's describing becomes clearer and clearer. What I'm still trying to understand is how this all ties with the concept of masculinity, being the protector and demanding respect, etc. Hard for me to currently discern what behaviors are just di dictated by the ego, which ones are necessary as a man and so on. Of course, one could say, just don't react to anything and ignore it, but that also seems like an easy way out, and sometimes I think a response is necessary. Maybe I have given you an idea for a future video, thanks. That is a great question. The way I saw your question was this, how do you know that your actions are dictated by the ego, and how do you know that your actions are just necessary as a man? It comes down to remembering that your ego is is a part of you. It's it's a part of your mind and it's there as a tool, right? The ego is only bad when it overpowers you, when it has a negative influence on you. When it has a positive influence, when it's working for you rather than against you, that's when the ego is a beautiful thing. Remember, it can be your best friend or your worst enemy. You gotta remember that masculine energy, it wants to penetrate the world, it wants to go after after its purpose, it wants to build, it wants to create. The answer is pretty much your intention behind it. Is it negative or is it positive? Is it putting down other people? Is it trying to raise other people up? It's all about your intention behind that action. What can you do to know, you know, if it's ego or if it's necessary, well, it's as simple as remembering your intention. So if it's negative, it's the ego. If it's positive, it's still the ego, right? But it's beneficial because it's, you know, serving other people. Deep down, you know what is positive. Great question. And if you guys have any more questions, just feel free to let me know in the comments. Do the hard work, especially when you don't feel like it.